Good morning. Uh, this video is for my e-learning media art students and I wanted to to introduce myself to some of the new students who are in our class. Uh, yesterday I didn't provide an update simply because I was doing some reorganizing. So let's start by going to mrsroseart.blogspot.ca. You see this URL right up here. And I'm going to click on this page, Digital Portfolios. Now I have a list of the students who are in our class. And for those who are in the class, you're going to notice that most of these names have um, a link associated with them. But the people who are still in white, uh, you haven't sent me your URL to your blog. So if you are one of the newcomers to the class, you're going to be heading over to our homepage for ASM 3.0. And you're going to go through all of the news over these past few weeks. Um, some of them are really short, like yesterday is really short, but some of them have videos just like you're hearing right now. And um, you'll be given instructions on uh, what to do for the class, how to create a blog, and before that even how to create a Google account. And then um, last week I created a Google form for you to submit that information to me on. Let me see if I can find it here. So that's what you're looking for. So Gmail addresses and URLs for your blog. So that's what I'd like to see. Uh, let me see what else am I looking for. So yeah, please look through, listen to all of the videos that are there and follow the instructions. Now moving on, not that I'm assigning this right away, but I want you to think about something over this long weekend. I know that Monday is a holiday, so that's a bonus. But your next assignment is going to be a video introduction. So you're going to be somehow introducing yourself. And I want you to think about a few things. Um, Basically, the video is just a way of your classmates and myself and possibly others, depending if you make this video public. Uh, I'd like to get to know you. I'd like to figure out who you are, maybe what you like, what you don't like, what your preference are, preferences are uh, using the internet, social media, whatever. But it's a, basically a glimpse into you, your world, and whatever else you choose to share. But before I actually give the assignment, I want you to start thinking about um, what videos, what kind of videos do you like and why you like them. Some people don't go that far. They just kind of consume that information that's available on the web. Um, but they don't think about why they like that or they don't even think about creating their own content for the web. So I want you to start thinking about that difference thinking about going beyond just um, liking videos and browsing through tons of selections, thousands of selections, uh, to maybe creating something and what are you going to make in that video. So I know that for myself these screencasts are relatively easy. I have the choice whether or not to, um, to show myself in the bottom corner so if you're not quite comfortable with people seeing your face and knowing your identity, then you have that option using Screencast-O-Matic. And you can, you can show maybe your blog if you'd like. This is mine, Northern Art Teacher. And this is where I do a lot of my reflective thinking. Um, if you have an Instagram account, maybe you'd like to show some of the pictures that you've taken and explain why you take certain pictures and how meaningful they are to you. You, like, For me, I like using Twitter to connect to other educators through, throughout the world and finding out what's, what's happening. And I like videos such as OK Go because, you know what, it's an insane amount of planning. If you go through this video and take a look, you can see just how much planning is involved when you get towards the middle and the end. Let me see if I can just kind of skip through to the middle. 
So it's not going to play very well. Anyway, you should go search out that video. Tell me if you like it. So what else? What else did I want you to ask? Okay, I made a few notes for myself. If you were going to make a video in the style of someone else, who would it be? Do you like any um, directors, filmmakers, videographers? Um, would you like to emulate their style or would you like to create your own stuff? What would you include if you were creating a video that helped us get to know you? Would you show yourself, just your screen, or would you film your world, so the things around you? And think about the audio that you're you're considering sharing as well. So it would be nice to hear your voice, but would you mash it up a little bit? Would you create a video that you could use some music in? Whatever, it'd be interesting. So that's where I'm going to leave you. I'm going to leave you thinking about that. I want you to start preparing ideas for your introductory video. I know I'm going to be creating this, the assignment itself over the weekend, but um, before you see the assignment, uh, I do want you to start thinking, okay, well, no matter what the assignment is going to be, I want these certain elements in there. So I want you to think a lot about it over the weekend. And if you do think about it, maybe write a blog post about the possibilities of this video and what we might see and what we might not see. Okay, so that's about it for now. Have a great weekend. And um, for those students who are new, again, please review all of the material on our homepage on the news. And, and again, a really good start on catching up. So email me if you need to know any more information. Have a great weekend.